What's up, everybody? Welcome back to It's Just Plastic. My name is Hound. You've seen the thumbnail. You know what? Hard to get figure I'm reviewing today. That's right. Better late than never. I got the Cobra Cobra Eel. That's right, boy. Number 81 from the G.I. Joe Classified line. This is one cool figure, but man, that was a hard one to get. Uh, Amazon, you got to do something about these exclusives because it was like exclusive, exclusive to who? Scalpers? Anyways, let's go ahead and get into the, let's check, check out the figure, check out the box. Really cool artwork on the side. There's that. Man, just stoked to finally have him. I, I think this is a real thing. It looks good. It looks legit for me from what I can tell. Uh, I haven't opened the box yet, but there's the back of the box. Pretty cool. 6.5 inches. I mean, there's barcode and everything. So, I mean, everything looks to be pretty legit. I hate the fact that it is in a plastic-free packaging, but I guess I can skip that part. I mean, I'll do it anyways, but... Uh, it is part of the plastic free packaging, so I will open it up on camera, I guess. It's a pretty old figure, but I still will, just on just in case it is a fake. I mean, maybe I can help somebody else later down the road that got a fake. But um, anyways, let's go ahead and before I open him up, go ahead and hit the like, hit the subscribe, check out all the links down below, everything you need to know down there. That's right. Uh, Entertainment Earth, discount link. It is an affiliate link. Gives me a little bit of a little little drop in a bucket and uh also it gives you 10 percent off you know if you meet their 50 60 70 whatever dollars entertainment earth wants to do nowadays uh, you will get free shipping with that link you can also use the you can either use the link or you can use code plastic at checkout um that will help me it helps you uh makari ebay that kind of stuff is down there as well if you want to check that out merch that kind of stuff is all down there but uh enough of that let's go ahead and pop this figure open and check him out Ah, right, let's go from the top. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Yeah. Y'all let me know if y'all see something that he may not be legit. Y'all let me know. Down in the comments, you let me know. Hit me up. Hit me up on Instagram or something. And then you just get the box. All right, let's go ahead and flip the camera and get into it. All right, so there he is out there on the table with all his accessories. Woo, man, it's pretty cool looking. I like these accessories. So, uh, you know, he's going to look good fighting Torpedo. That will be cool. Uh, let's go ahead and start with his mask. I like how they got that see-through so you can see his little face back there. You know, sometimes they'd be putting these things with, uh, you know, not clear plastic they put it with like a silver or something i don't like that i always like to be able to see through so that's pretty cool actually took the time to actually do that everything looks pretty cool there's a nut little knife that he comes with got two fins got a left and a right obviously it's actually labeled so that's good like i said y'all see something that looks like it may be a, a knockoff y'all let me know That looks good. A little propulsion. I bet you could find something to plug in there. Maybe not fire, but maybe like a like a, like a, a blue something, like a blue flame or something. That might be cool to put in there. These are the hoses attached right there for the mask. Pretty cool. And then you got the same harpoon gun as uh as torpedo look at that, hanging off the end there look at that look at all the look at all the gold missing on that dog look at that right there what is that hasbro or is that somebody else y'all y'all let me know <laughs> All right, here's the figure. Something I noticed. I was looking at his feet. We'll go over it in just a second, but I wanted to show you. Look at his feet. Why has he got extra numbers? What's the brown numbers for? What's the reason for that? Y'all let me know. 
This guy has, bro. I don't know. And a bad paint app just says Hasbro to me, not not knockoff. <laughs> knockoff probably got better paint app. I saw he's got a like a gouge in the knee. See that right there? Let's see, he's got that. That needs to be trimmed. I'm happy. I'm happy I got him. I, I didn't pay as much as some of these other folks, so you know. I'm glad I got him for a I wouldn't say a decent price. It wasn't retail by any means, but you know. Just a couple bucks over. Oh, that ain't too bad. I can handle that. That's why I was worried he might be a knockoff, so but uh I guess y'all want to look at our articulation. Down, up, 360 should be no problem. Up to the side, no problem. Bicep swivel was kind of, yeah, bicep swivel was stuck right there. See that? That stinks because you can't get a full rotation out of that because of the, uh, the shoulder here. Is this side the same way? Yep. Well, that stinks. Huh. Not a very good idea. Double jointed, pinless elbows. You got typical Hasbro wrists. Nothing crazy. Crunch should be good. Rotation, not a problem. Side, drop down hips, hate those things. Upper thigh swivel, double jointed, pinless knees. And you don't have a boot swivel because there's not really a boot tip. Oh, but you do get a lower there it is it's the lower swivel and then you get a uh, typical hasbro ankle rockers so yeah not too shabby man I, i'm i'm like i said i'm happy i finally can add him to the collection he's gonna look good with torpedo i uh, don't have any other guys to battle with as of right now as y'all well know kind of stinks but we'll get some more water folks eventually hopefully hopefully uh undertow and some others are will come soon. Just kind of trying to show you guys decking him out here. I know you've probably seen this a million times, but not for me. <laughs> and I know I'm y'all's favorite, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm your favorite underrated reviewer, right? That's right. So cool, man. Super, super cool. Plugs in real easy. Y'all know that. I like how they leave that so you can still plug it into something. That's, that's a really good idea. I like that. There you go. No need to give him his gun. You got the gist. <laughs> I've seen some people saying that he was a pretty bad figure, but I think he's pretty cool, man. And I mean, bad in a bad way, not in a bad as a like, yeah. Like, <laughs> I think he's a pretty cool figure. I mean, he's definitely got his issues, but psh, he came from Hasbro. Of course, he has issues. <laughs> <laughs> I like Hasbro better than some of the other ones, but let's be honest, they got issues just like everybody else does. So, you know, hey, it is what it is. Uh, I, I definitely think he's a pretty cool character, a uh, cool figure. I'm glad I finally can add him to the collection. I uh, wish I would have got him for retail. I wish Amazon and all these exclusives would uh, either go away or figure out a way to so everybody can get one. Don't make Army Builders exclusives. That's one problem. Let's not do that one. How about that? But anyways, you guys have already heard this a million times from other people. That just drives me crazy. All right, I appreciate you guys stopping by. Hit the like and subscribe. Appreciate everything. You guys are awesome. You guys take care. Have a good one. And remember, it's just plastic. Hey!